we have a large portfolio uh, around the world. Uh, many of these solar plants are in Asia, um, in Thailand, in Vietnam, uh, in Japan, but also in UK and in Australia. I am working on one project in Vietnam, in the south of Vietnam. Uh, it's 250 megawatts. We collect data from sensor and meter installed during the construction phase. And with this big data, the machine learning helps us to, to define for us a model, an energy behavior, thanks to, to this data like irradiance, humidity, hair pressure. But we have also to take into account the module degradation and the shading sand. For example, now in Vietnam, we have a lot of grid curtailment, so the electrical network reduced the set point for this solar plant. But with this model and with this energy simulation, we can now have the possibility to say to our client um, the energy that we should be produced for at this moment and also to quantify uh, and to count the energy losses and the financial losses. The next step will be to continue to improve this model for this specific uh, project. And we also want to continue to use machine learning to help us for the future uh, solar farm project.